speed. <laughs> Folks, we're starting news night here at 5 o'clock early because of this chase right now going on live in the metro here. Suspects on the run. Let's check in with Jim Gardner and Bob Mills Sky News 9. Jim. Well, that's right. This is a chase that uh, I'm not exactly where it started when we first heard it. It was around uh, Northeast 50th and I-35 on the service road going northbound. It went over to Coltrane, come southbound on Coltrane, come up here to Northeast 23rd. He went westbound on Northeast 23rd, and then he made a, on a street right here into a little parking lot where he jumped out and uh, he uh, he basically started running, but then he surrendered. So they've taken him into custody right now. Now this uh, person was driving this gray Ford pickup, and what I understand, he has hit several cars along the way here as he uh, traveled from uh, Northeast 50th and uh, I-35 going northbound on the service road, and then back over to Coltrane and southbound on Coltrane. He's hit several cars. We haven't checked that out yet to see how many cars were damaged or hit. At this time, I have no reports of injuries from him hitting any of those cars. But right now you're seeing the aftermath of that and the end of this as uh, he went into this parking lot. I think he took a wrong turn. I don't think he was familiar with this street. So when he turned in on this side street, he turned into this parking lot at the top of the screen. And you'd see the F-150 right there is what he was driving at times going down Northeast 23rd. He was well over 80 miles an hour going down Northeast 23rd. And it's a very busy street. Luckily, nobody else was injured in this. But he uh, basically, he they took him into custody right here with no resistance, which is good. So as we get this all pieced together and try to find out why they were in pursuit of this person and why he was running, and uh, evidently he sure wasn't wanting to get caught because he hit several cars. And we'll try to find out the damage, uh, how many cars were hit, and make sure that nobody was injured. But this is where it ended just north of Northeast 23rd. Uh, just, uh, I believe that, uh, let's see what street that is. That's Bryant Avenue. That's going to be Bryant Avenue that it ended on, just north of Northeast 23rd and Bryant Avenue at this church right here. We can get more. We'll keep you updated. Jim Garpoint live from Bob Mills. Scotty's 9. Back to you. All right, Jim, we appreciate it. Thanks so much. You're watching News 9 here at 5 o'clock.